Hey there, Jane. What made you want to be? So this is a recent video that I updated. It's called Two AIs Talk About Artificial Intelligence. And this is a video that was completely created using AI. So I'm going to show you how I created this video. So the first thing I did was use AI to generate the dialogue. To do this, I went to the website beta.openai.com because on this site, you can use their GPT-3 model, and this will allow you to do some really cool things in terms of generating the dialogue. So when you log into the site, you can choose examples. And if you scroll all the way to the bottom, there is one program where it will automatically generate interview questions. So I'm going to open that in the playground and rather than using science fiction author, I'm just going to change this to generate a list of eight questions for my interview with a synthetic actor. So these are the questions that I used for the video. So I also used another application that's available under the examples, and that one is the chat that's at the bottom of the page. So I went line by line, and I copied each question, and I pasted it in the chat where I was able to use AI to generate a response. So after a while, I had the entire dialogue set. The next thing I had to do was use the app Synthesia to create the actual video of the synthetic actors. So once I logged into Synthesia, the first thing I did was select my actor, select my voice, and then take all of the questions and paste them in individual slides for the host to ask. So this is all of the questions for my host. And I did the same thing for my guests. Now you can see I tried to put pauses in so that the videos would line up perfectly. It didn't quite work out that way, so I had to do a little bit of editing to make sure that everything looked good when you saw it in the video. But once I was done with both of these, I just selected Generate Video. Synthesia went through and generated that in a video that I can download. I'm going to share the link if you want to see more about this process. And then the last step was just to put the videos together side by side, just like you're seeing right now. If you look closely, you can even see the jump cuts where I had to do a little bit of that editing. But for the most part, I think it turned out good. So if you have any questions on this process, either on OpenAI or on Synthesia, go ahead and leave them in the comment section below. Finally.